please join us for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. For the invocation, I have a prayer from Mother Teresa. People are often unreasonable, irrational, and self-centered. Forgive them anyway. If you are kind, people may accuse you of selfish, ulterior motives. Be kind anyway. If you are successful, you will win some unfaithful friends and some genuine enemies. Succeed anyway. If you are honest and sincere, people may deceive you. Be honest and sincere anyway. What you spend years creating, others could destroy overnight. Create anyway. If you find serenity and happiness, some may be jealous. Be happy anyway. The good you do today will often be forgotten. Do good anyway. Give the best you have, and it will never be enough. Give your best anyway. Thank you. According to all known laws of, uh, my mistake, it seems like I have the wrong script. <laughs> uh, you know, in traditional lamp fashion, I, uh, I wrote the speech an hour ago. <clears throat> what is one word that can define our class? Hmm. What about change? We saw almost too much of that. From exam formats, APUSH, AP Euro, PSAT, SAT, to the massacre of our cherished chickens, May they rest in pieces. <laughs> what, too soon? <laughs> it feels like we didn't go a single year without us suffering through change. We even changed schools. Granted, the change wasn't the best, but at least they promised us a new school. <laughs> hey, at least LAMP is going to get a new building after we leave. <laughs> we also saw the coming and going of many a beloved teacher. But through it all, we endured. Maybe that's a better word. Not that we suffered all the change, the turmoil, but we endured it. We entered high school unprepared for what LAMP had in store for us, but we came out proud and strong. We left our mark at LAMP. Now, all that is left is to leave our mark on the rest of the world. We are prepared for college. No, rather, college isn't prepared for us. Sure, we hit a few rough patches on our journey, but we made it. The storm has finally cleared. Now, to brave the other largest storm on the horizon or as some people like to call it, life. We are a constantly evolving school. From our start over 30 years ago in Lanier to our time in the worn down yet homey Loveless building. To yet another closing chapter in our history, our unexpected but at least eventually welcome stay in Houston Hill. And although my classmates and I will not be here to see it, LAMP is moving forward into its latest home, just as we too are moving into our new homes. I think that we've done pretty well, given it all. We've taken everything in stride, making sure to take that LAMP spirit wherever we go. We as a class have been a part of many firsts. The first student ambassadors, the first members of History Honor Society and Science Honor Society, the first place in the penny drive this year. Um, 
I'm proud to look at everything we have done as a school and what will continue to be done in the years to come. Most of all, I'm proud of my senior class. Although we all have our own passions inside and outside of school, whether it's athletic or academic teams, art, science, service, or faith, we have still managed to come together as one unified class, representing LAMP in our academics and our extracurriculars. From freshmen in the Loveless Building to seniors at Houston Hill, back to freshmen once again, um, we are taking our passions to other places. And as we move on to what I think is our biggest change yet, all I have to say is, love less, do more. As in, the, as in the prologue of the Canterbury Tales, a passage near and dear to every senior's heart, these years have been the prologue to our adult lives. Instead of one that April, ours begins with one that May. This moment, with all of us here for this time-honored ceremony, this is when our lives move from the prologue to the epic adventure on which we will all embark. So thank you all for joining us here today. Our quest and adventures will all be different. Some of us will seek a medical degree, others a Juris Doctorate, others still may pursue engineering, the sciences, or a teaching license, and some may choose to stay here and raise a family. Forgive me if I miss your chosen field, but there's no way I could have named all of them, because no two of us are going to do the exact same thing for the exact same reason, so it would have been impossible to name them all. No two are going to be the same, but I know that all of them will be honorable and worthy. The past four years, and more for those of us who've been together seemingly forever, haven't been easy. There have been tests and papers that none of us were prepared for, there were friendships lost, and there were fights that rocked our class. But for every test that we collectively failed, for every friendship that fragmented, and for every fight that took place, there was a growing sense of community, friendships gained, and an increased unity. In the writing of this speech, I found a new meaning for our prologue. One that May is directly taken to mean at this time in May, but there's a different interpretation and I like this one more. Instead, I like to think of it as when that time may come. I won't pretend that everyone here likes everyone else or that everyone gets along, but for every one of us here, there's someone in our corner, someone who's been rooting for us for all these years and someone who won't ever stop rooting for us. And though we don't get along with everyone, someone else's success won't ever diminish our own, so we're all cheering each other on. And one that time may come when you're in need of support or when you've achieved all your wildest dreams, there'll be someone here who's been cheering for you for longer than you can remember, and we'll all be here to cheering you on forevermore. I'm delighted that today, at least, each of you will get the individual recognition that you deserve for your accomplishments are many. But know that moving forward, the eyes of your LAMP family and those of the world will be on you as leaders and innovators, changing the world to make it a better place for everyone in it. For you must remember, to those who much is given, much is expected, and much has been given to all of us. Whatever field you choose, whatever path you take, you have been adequately prepared with the tools necessary for you to succeed in that. There will be hard work ahead for all of us, no doubt but it's no more than we can handle. After all, we did handle LAMP all these years with everyone telling us how hard it was. So go forth, seniors. Be the people that serve. Be the people that create and rejuvenate. Be the leaders. Don't be afraid to change the world, because you will. Bear the torch, LAMPers. Thank you. Good evening. I've been told to keep it short and sweet this evening, and I plan on doing just that, because no one came here to hear a long-winded speech full of mystic platitudes that we all already accept anyway. So instead, to the class of 2017, I give two final instructions. But before I give you my last instructions, I want to say thank you. Thank you to the class of 2017 for your hard work and dedication. You've shown me how hard Lampers work to to achieve and excel each and every day. You have indeed excelled academically, 
Just look at the back of your program at the long list of schools they'll attend. Artistically, our jazz band is going to perform. They're going to be amazing. And athletically, all of you found your place at LAMP, and LAMP is better for it. Whew. These instructions will at times be easy, and they will be hard, both for you and them. My final instructions to you, the class of 2017, are to go and do. Seems easy, right? Just wait. The easy part's over. Go. This is the easy one. All of you are preparing to go out to school and into the world. And remember that as you go, your parents' love, dedication to you, and support is making your going possible. All of the practices, recitals, plays, rehearsals, contests, competitions are paying off for you as you unmoor yourself from your parents' steadfast guiding hands. But remember, while you're off going and doing, they still control all the bill paying. <laughs> Heed my advice here. It's important. You don't need a new t-shirt or a sweatshirt every time you walk into the university bookstore. Used books are totally awesome because they have highlighted portions in the text that'll help you out, I suggest them. And no matter what, I repeat, do not, do not sign up for a credit card in exchange for a t-shirt. I'm still living that one down. Please don't do it. <laughs> Author Tom Wolfe said the following about going. Make your mistakes. Take your chances. Look silly, but keep going. Don't freeze up. Don't freeze up. That sounds a lot like my next instruction. Do. Do what? Your best. Always. In all things. Because you are the best. Take chances. Meet new people. Try new things. Experience failure. Because after all, failure is our best teacher. Trust me. I know. Do also means to expand your horizons through experiences. Do take time to enjoy the experience of higher education. It will truly be a crucible of defining moments and experiences that will mold you into the adult you will be. My best advice for doing is to find your passion and do it. Do it with fidelity and gusto because in, during this time of doing, you will put into practice the lessons, ethics, and morals your parents and teachers have spent 17 or 18 years crafting and molding. Do not waste our efforts. But remember, while you're off doing, others will be there to distract and detract from what you're doing, so remain steadfast. There's a Chinese proverb that says, the person who says something is impossible should not interrupt the person doing it. I, your teachers, and most importantly, your parents, are not asking for you to solve all of the world's problems, just a majority of them. So don't let us interrupt you. Now get going, start doing, know that we all love you, that we're all here when you need us for anything. And yes, no matter what, we will have food, money, and plenty of laundry detergent. Godspeed, class of 2017. As we move into the presentation of the diplomas, I would ask that our audience remember that this is, a, this is a ceremony of dignity. I would ask that we hold our applause until the end so that all of our graduates can be recognized equally. Thank you. Daniel Thomas Allen. Christina Chanel Asbury. C. 
Sarah Elizabeth Adkins. Junghoon Bay. Jonathan Abraham Bailey. Julia Reagan Barfoot. Jessica Lynn Bargainer. Sawyer Hayes Batson. Samantha Nicole Bell. Lillian Margaret Black. Savannah Alexis Nicole Booker. Clifton Caleb Borders. Kennedy Michelle Bray. Joshua Su Breckenridge. Cassidy Michelle Brown. Cecile Louise Brown. Marley Adriana Bryant. Max Harold Bryant. Jacqueline Marie Bai. Amber J. Carter. Ann Rachel, Rachel Chamberlain. Rachel Ann Champion. Parker Jake Chavers. Sung Kyu Choi, and he will be attending the University of Chicago. Casey Tatum Colazzo. D'Angelo Marcellus Cooper.
Zaria Tierra Coprich. Allison Della Catherine Corson. Ashton Elizabeth Cross. Danica Justine Bandal de Jesus. Elizabeth Ann Dudley. Caroline Elizabeth Diamond. Mariah Catherine Ellis. Lindsay Morgan Elrod. Michaela Angelica Toledo Enriquez. Takira Kiandra Maishe Fisher. Abigail Elaine Franklin. John Allen Frost. Harmony Amaru Fry. Andrew David Gale. Sarah Sellers Gillis. Tasia Gingipali. Lauren Ashley Green. Deja Simone Hampton. Brianna Lee Haney. Bentley Nicole Harden. Anne Grace Hartman. Fariha Nasmoon Hassan. Muhammad Ahmad Hashmi. (coughs) 
Michael Thomas Head. Robert Eric Highland III. Nikita Hingorani. Megan Michael Michelle Holloway Ragland. Leah Chan Holtbum. Farhan Nakib Hossein. Brianna Nicole Hewlett. Jimin M. Matthew Graham Ingram. Jayung Kong. Youngje Ko <coughs> Joseph Stephen Columbini Kilpatrick <coughs> Jungwoo Kim Jared Ryan King. Teho Ro. Gerald George Lash the Third. Hewan Lee. Jacob Young Lee. James Young Lee. Larry Elmore Langford Luster. Brandon Clay Mackey. Lauren Tania Maddox. Jessica Anita Malone.
John Winston Morgan II. Michelle V. Wynn. Jessica Lauren Norris. Mary Catherine Norris. Babette Odion Oviagele Simone Annabelle Pack Megna Hement Patel Adam James Peck. Ernest Stephen Porterfield. Caleb Hayden Probst. Hayden McKinley Pruitt. Parth Chetun Runchod. Anna Caroline Roberts. Aniakan Abasi Mpong Ruffin. Sabrina Henna Sabir. Carter Elliot. Solera Carmen Ariana Saunders Emily Aaron Sellers Megan Christine Shearer. William Michael Shirley. Charles Pruitt Singleton. Joshua Knight Scipio. J. 
Jerry Daniel Slocum, Jr. Brianna McKaylin Smith. Savannah Grace Snowden. Anton Christian St. Clair. Mario Mircha Stan. Billy Matthew Thompson. Corianne Rose Tiazzi. Ebony Deanne Tolliver. Alexandria Blake Trammer. Paul Jordan Tulo. Michaela Joy Walker. Meili Wong. Cameron Bryant Washington. William Jordan Watkins. Mackenzie Ann Watley. Helena Berhanu Waldemichael. Aaron Lee Word. Emily Elizabeth Yeend.
Would you please now join me and stand and, sing and join me in singing the, the Lamp Alma Mater? Gentlemen, please remove your hats.